I am in the maintenance group now, and it was so funny because it was like um, it was like going from sort of primary school into secondary school. You know, you'd got so used to your group of girls, and we call ourselves, you know, the Sunday the Sunday girls, and it was something that I really looked forward to. And it was funny thinking back to only a few months before when I'd been going, please don't make me go to these groups. I don't want to go, and how I actively look forward to them. So although I'm in the maintenance group which happens at 11 o'clock as opposed to sort of 9.30. What I often do is, if I can, work allowing and family allowing, I'll go to the earlier group and see the girls for sort of, you know, 10 minutes, get me way in, and then go to the, uh, go to the maintenance group. And we keep, in we keep in touch by email as well, and uh, everybody's very, very supportive. You know, sometimes, Sometimes it, it's, um, I mean, there's lots of laughs, lots of laughs, I have to say, but there's also a lot of tears. I hadn't realised just how, how much people used food as emotional comfort. And it's incredible to see where some of these girls have been and how they've got, and, and to see them week after week still being delighted that they're keeping their, uh, keeping their weight down. So it's, I find the whole thing of this incredibly fascinating. One of the main myths is that I'm frightened of food packs because when I stop, I'll pile on the weight. My friend Sue, I know this Sue's getting a lot of... My friend Sue, she did lighter life and she's put all the weight back on. Well, that's because Sue went back to eating all the pies. So what I try to say is that all of us would do that, is that you have to learn how not to do that. And by doing that, you have to go to the groups. And I have had so many people, I mean literally quite a lot of people, friends and friends of friends, who have started Lighter Life because of me. And I feel quite proud of it because they, A, they've seen me lose the weight and look and feel better than I have done in years. Because when I'd lost weight before, it wasn't necessarily for the right reasons. I wasn't getting the right nutrients. I was like lots of people. I'd binge eat and then I'd starve myself. That was the way that I, you know, that I thought that you did it. So I'm getting all the right nutrients. So people see that I'm looking and feeling much better than I ever did. And that they know that I'm also someone who's quite honest. That I would say, oh, but you've got to go to the groups, but you've just got to go through them. That I, I'm very vocal about saying it's because of the group that I've managed to maintain the weight.